Hi, I'll be taking a closer look at four LED light bulbs available today. Two newer bulbs available this year are the Sylvania Ultra and the Switch Infinia. Both of these are $15. Returning from my last video are bulbs from Cree and Philips, now available at lower prices in stores. While the specs are similar, there's a big range of efficiencies. More importantly though, I'd like to look at the difference in design and light output. I chose only warm white bulbs that are dimmable and send light in all directions, just like a real incandescent bulb. Cheaper LED bulbs don't have these capabilities, which are important if you want to truly get the most out of your light fixture. Each bulb does this slightly differently. Pay attention not only to the direct look of the lit bulbs, but also any darker areas where they don't send as much light out. Here's a quick test of turn-on time, a common complaint with CFLs. All the new LEDs turn on quickly, aside from the old 2011 Philips and back. Let's slow it down so you can see. Now let's see how they handle dimming. The LEDs dim smoothly and go quite low, with the exception of a small hiccup towards the low end with the switch bulb. Notice the dimmable CFL is horrible in comparison. LED bulbs work best with standard incandescent dimmers. Dimming up from off is handled well by all but the switch as well. Now I want to demonstrate another issue, flicker. I'm using a high-speed camera to show the Cree bulb has a serious flicker problem, while a small mount's also visible with the Sylvania and switch bulbs. While this is too fast to normally be noticeable, some people may be sensitive to it, especially when moving quickly. It's a good indication of cost cutting in the power supply and possibly shortened lifetime. With the dimmer turned down about 50%, flicker is no worse with the LEDs, however the dimmable CFL is really bad. The Sylvania bulb looks like it's trying to fight a big heat problem. Performance per watt or dollar is the lowest, and design is unusual. In contrast, the switch has a clean design that's closest to a real bulb. The LEDs are actually sitting in fluid, so the heat is handled very well. As a result, the switch is the only bulb rated for enclosed fixtures. Cree made impressive innovations in their bulb to cut costs and really open up the market last year. Components rattle inside though, the supply is a strong flicker, and my biggest issue is really the lack of output from the top of this bulb. Most of my fixtures really depend on output from the top. So the Philips remains my pick. It's built to a higher quality, has zero flicker, great top and side output, and looks the best from the top in open fixtures like my ceiling fan. I've had so much faith in the Philips and its fully sealed electronics that while not rated for it, I've had two running fully exposed to the elements outside for six months with no issues. In fact, they're now sold in pairs cheaper than any other bulbs. Thanks for watching.